I'd like to just give a mo moment to introduce our chairman of the school board, Karen Carpenter. Thank you all for being here. Thanks to Gettle for uh, this wonderful event and the funds that they have provided. And thanks to the Manatee Education Foundation for coordinating all of this. But most importantly, thank you to all of you in the schools, the teachers, the principals, and the other staff. You're the heart and soul of what we do here in Manatee County, and you're doing a great job. Thank you. Thank you, Karen. Also, I'd like to introduce from Gettle Automotive Group, Mr. Fred Bartholomew. Thank you and welcome. I want to just tell you we're really excited to have you all here. It's great to have so many teachers here. It's great to have so many winners here. It's really a wonderful experience for us. I hope you're happy to be here. We're thrilled to have you here. Um, I had said on the, the uh, last quarterly get-together that we had that this really means a lot to me and to all the associates that work here at Get a Automotive. There's five or six hundred of us and uh, all of us have had personal experiences with the school system and uh, so personally uh, I handed you uh, three boys and uh, got them successfully off into college. So uh, I have a personal uh, indebtedness to all the teachers that did that for myself and my family, and it's really rewarding to work for a company that believes in giving back to some of the real fundamentals that help our community, the children, and the teachers that work so hard to bring up those children in a way that makes them productive and, and uh, can turn out to uh, have good jobs like, uh, like I have in the car business. So welcome, really thrilled to have you here, uh, and uh, we're going to get on with the awards, is that right? Great, thank you. Okay, we will start. Able Elementary, Jill Flores. From Anna Maria L., Nick LaDuke. From Ballard Elementary, Heather Zink. From Bushaw Elementary, Susan Matamore. From Bayshore Elementary, Madhu Guru Swami. Did I do okay on that? <laughs> um, Bayshore High, yeah. Michelle Johnson. Thank you. From Blackburn Elementary, James Jocko. You can come straight up, come straight up the middle. From Bra Blackburn Elementary, James Jocko. From Braden River Elementary, from Braden River Middle, Michelle McClellan. <laughs> Braden River High, Jessica Reed. From Buffalo Creek Middle, Joan Thomas. From Central High, David Van Etten. From Daughtry Elementary, Jennifer Tress. From Freedom Elementary, Kelly Jomesco. Also from Gullet Elementary, Brandy Whitman. Great. 
from Hale Middle, Angela Ballard. Congratulations. From Harley Middle, Tanya Batchelor. Here comes Tanya. From Horizons Academy, Dave McCarran. From Johnson Middle, Deborah Peters. Congratulations. And from King Middle, Rob Powers. And from Canaan Elementary, Angela DeAngelis. Congratulations, Rob. Thanks. From Lakewood Ranch High, Tammy Harper. Lee Magnet Middle, Jeff McDaniel. That's great. From Lincoln Middle, Keith Coffey. From MTI East, John Kenny. From Manatee L. Roy Feneff. McNeil Elementary, Alice Lander. The name right. Great, thank you very much. <laughs> Miller Elementary, Jennifer Harrison. Mills Elementary, Maureen Perinello. <laughs> and from Moody Elementary, Amber Kukuk. Congratulations. Amber. Congratulations. And Amber. Mayaka Elementary, Lauren Riccio. From Nolan Middle, Mary Ann Maginot. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Also from Oniko Elementary, Jennifer Sloan. Here's Jennifer Sloan. Orange Ridge Elementary, Joyce Bird. Joyce Bird. And from Palm View Elementary, Nicole Gallen. Palmetto Elementary, Jenna Cusano. Palmetto High, Darlene Lott. 
Darlin, right? Prine Elementary, Linda O'Hop. From Rogers Garden Elementary, Unique L. Russell. Isn't that great, Mobile Charles? From Rollette Elementary, Dolores Hyatt. Unique? Dolores. Samoset Elementary, Sarah Mitchell. <laughs> From Seabreeze Elementary, Lori Catalani. It's <laughs> <laughs> a good sign. Thank you. Thank you very much. Southeast High School, Brian McKnight. Come on up, Brian. Thank you. From Stewart Elementary, Kim Carter. <laughs> Sug Middle, Valerie Montgomery. From Terra Elementary, Linda Haluska, or Haluska. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Congratulations. Thank you. Tillman Elementary, Angie Williams. Congratulations to you. Thank you. Wakeland Elementary, Jane Ellen Zimmerman. Williams Elementary, Shirley Pride. Hello, Jane. Come on around. Have a great time. Thank you. That's right. That way we can't mess up. And from Willis Elementary, Lori Ron. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, Shirley. Witt Elementary, Carol Ricks. And that is our teachers for this quarter. Congratulations to all of you. A big round of applause for everyone. Thank you, principals. Thank you, school administrators and guests and Gettel for this wonderful event. Thank you very much for having me in this interview. It's really a pleasure for us at Get Automotive to be a sponsor of this event. We think it's so important to be involved in the community and particularly in those events that impact children and teachers. And that's where our future lies. So it's great to be in the car business supporting the education industry. This is the third time that we've done a quarterly award, so we're only one more quarter away from the grand prize, which we're really excited about already, and the Educator of the Year will receive a brand new Prius, courtesy of Gettle Automotive. Well, we are just thrilled to be in partnership with Gettle Automotive Group. Probably several months back, I got a call from Ellen Walther, the PR person, and we met with Bob Blisplinghoff and Jim Gettle. And I was in a meeting with all of them in a room, and we talked about the kinds of things that we wanted to do and get them to get involved with the school district. And lo and behold, in the meeting, Mr. Gettle, Jim Gettle, said, what about giving a brand new Prius to the teacher? And I, I was literally almost fell off my chair and was walking on air out of that meeting. We were so excited. And then to find out that the other districts in the, where they have dealerships, Alachua County, Marion County, 
were, were also going to be receiving these cars was just such a great thing. So it was a great meeting. We love working with Gettle. They are just so generous and so kind. They're going to be hosting a reception here for the teachers, and many of our principals come and the administrators come, and we do it every quarter, so we're excited about this. It makes it an absolutely wonderful experience for our associates that work here. It's really rewarding to know that the people that you work for are generous, that they're involved, and that they're interested in things that are going on other than what happens here at our dealerships. So it's meant a lot to us, and I would like to thank Mary because we absolutely could not have done it without her support. I'm here with Chairman Karen Carpenter from the school board, and we're at the third annual Teacher Appreciation Awards at Gettle Automotive Group. And I wanted to ask you what your impressions of this are. We've been, I know you've been to several of them, and it would be interesting to hear your perspective. Well, thank you, Mary. You know, teaching the teachers are the most important uh, aspect of what goes on in learning. And I heard a, a statement last week that instruction without love is not teaching. So we know how hard these teachers work, and uh, we are very appreciative, not only to Gettle, but the Manatee Education Foundation for coordinating all of this to give the teachers a boost. Oh, well, thank you, and we're so glad you're here tonight. And I know the teachers are, they, they just love to get something where it's a reward for, their, for them, and they can do whatever they'd like with the funds. That's what's nice. That's it can right. be in the classroom or for whatever they want. So we're happy that a lot of our principals show up here tonight and a lot of the administration. So it'll be a fun night. It's good. It means a lot, not only to our school system, but to our whole community, obviously our teachers. Um, this is the third one. They've all been extremely well attended, which shows you how important it is for our schools and our teachers to have this level of recognition. Uh, so often the, the work of our teachers isn't recognized, and this is just a wonderful way for our community to get together and celebrate what they do every day. Well, it just shows the potential, what can happen with education when, when we do have uh, corporate sponsors, when we do have our community so involved in recognizing the most important work that we do is what our teachers do with our kids. Uh, you know, anything that we can do to expand the recognition of our teachers uh, would be a remarkable thing for us. That What they do every day needs to be rewarded, and the more we can do, the better it will be. I think this is a fantastic thing to get started in the elementary schools, middle schools, and high schools in Manatee County. As a second year teacher, I think this is such an achievement to be voted by my colleagues at my school. I think teachers work very, very hard. That Our jobs are our lives, so I think it's very important to be acknowledged by our community that we work hard to make all of our children love coming to school and to love learning. I say no matter an award or not an award, your work is still going to be shown. Everyone's going to see how hard you work, but to get an achievement like this is fabulous. Well, this is just, Charlie, this is just great. I mean, our teachers, we have so many great people that do it every day. They show up, they try to make sure those kids get the teaching, the education they deserve. They understand that those are the future of our country and our community. So it's just really great that Gettle has, you know, found a way to recognize them and, and is doing so much to reward them for all the effort. So just really, it's really gratifying. Well, I mean, you look around this room and it's just awesome. The, the, uh, the energy in this room, they're talking to each other, they're wanting to be better, and uh, that's what it's all about. We build this team to give our kids the best education we can. Step up to the plate. We can use all the help we can get. It's been a tough time for, our, for all of our people. And, you know, we genuinely appreciate all of the businesses that are stepping up. And we truly appreciate Gettle stepping up and doing this for our teachers. Well, first of all, it's recognition by their peers. It's nominations that are uh, created by the peers, other people that see them working in the classroom, working with students. And so from there, there's a, a secret ballot and a drawing from the principal and a senior secretary. So it is quite an honor because it is recognition by the people who know what a great job she does. It's great that businesses, community members are supportive of public education, especially all the hard work that teachers do, that it does take a village to raise students. And it's nice that Ghetto Toyota is part of that mission to raise students the right way to support the community. Keep working hard. People do notice excellence, and it's uh, nice that Ghetto Toyota does recognize excellence, voted on by the peers. So just keep working and, and doing what's best for students. And this is a, a, an example of 
what can be done to help make education better in Manatee County. And uh, Gettles are an example. You know, they, they set the pace, really, for involvement, and I thank them very much. Well, it really is a thrill. It makes you tingle a little bit because you see all these people from all grades, all the schools, who, who give so much. It's more than a, a nine to five job. I know many of these teachers are working at night. They're, they're working off contract, so to speak, because they love teaching and they love kids. And it, it's, it, it's a thrill to me to be a, a small part of this. And I, I just am glad I could be here. It means a lot to me, you know, to see the teachers have an opportunity to be rewarded. You know, so many times you see the different things that go on related to them. Their jobs are extremely tough, so it's great to see that they now have the opportunity to be rewarded at the end of the year. Yeah, it's very, it's, it's ideal to recognize them. Because the thing that, that, that makes up a teacher, we know that they learn, dream, and achieve, and they really worked hard. So to see that they're finally being rewarded for the day-to-day -day work, some of them show up to work early, they stay late, they put in extra time, they go beyond the call of duty, and it's just nice to see that they are appreciated. It, it means a lot because it shows that we're in it together. You know, we're not in this alone. Business and industry recognizes the job at hand of what we are tasked to do. When we have a successful student in this environment, everyone succeeds. This is a total effort of the entire community. So we want to put that back where it belongs and benefit all students and teachers and businesses.